Politicians, and especially those who support President Uhuru Kenyatta, maintain they have all the confidence in the IEBC in the upcoming by-elections on 15th this month. Oh. MP Kanini Kega from Kenny, Kiabu Township, Judy Jomo, and Kajedo North MP Joseph Maji are among politicians who are calling on their colleagues to give area residents the freedom to make their own choice. I will challenge the security agencies to be vigil and make sure that they don't allow any un uncredited person in the polling stations. We hope IEBC Itaweza to conduct a free and fair election and election free of any turmoil. Politicians, wote wakae kando, ili yule atakayo shinda ayo mshidani wa ukweli. A similar statement was echoed by lawmakers who are affiliated to the UDA party while insisting that the results of the by-elections will be used as a mirror of next year's general election. Confidence with the ABC because they conducted the exercise in the Juja by-election very good and, and very well. I am saying the buck stops with the commander-in-chief of all the armed forces, His Excellency President Uhuru Kenyatta. He must ensure that the people of Kiamba are given the opportunity to elect a leader that they want. On his part, IBC Chairman Wafura Chebukati, during his visit to Kiabu County Commissioner's Office, has made it clear that all preparations for the by-elections are well addressed. It's provided for in law that the commission shall be assisted by other stakeholders, mainly being the county administration and uh, especially the security in delivery of our mandate. However, he issued a stern warning to politicians against engaging in election malpractices with a similar statement echoed by his colleague Mohamed Abdi Gurie. We will not allow people running around claiming to be agents. There is nothing like protecting votes. IABC is competent enough. We share a number of officers and already we share the deployment with the electoral body. We are set for the by-election. Kiaba and Mogoga by-elections appear to be a litmus paper for the next general election after President Kenyatta complete his term, with his deputy William Ruto appearing to test his popularity in presidential ambition in Kiabu and the larger Mount Kenya region. Reporting for K24 Evening Edition, my name is Paul Jao.